I'm Mo Williams, NBA professional basketball player. I'm here today joined by my good friend Jordy. Today we'll be talking about shooting. We're going to be doing two drills of shooting. First one, we're going to do right around the goal, and it's going to show you the proper way to shoot a jump shot. Then we'll step back after that and give you a full version of it in full speed. Um, first, we're going, to, we're going to start here. And, you know, for, for, all, you, for all you youngsters, really, and uh, e even guys that are trying to become better shooters and even shooters that want to take their shooting to another level, um, this is the proper way to do it. I'm going to do it once without the ball so you can see it. You want to get, it's a drill that we all do, I still do to this day. We stand here. You want to drop your, drop your right arm. You're going to bring it up, but the key is to do it all in one motion because when, when your elbow always stays in, when it comes up, your hips simultaneously at the same time is dropping. When the ball goes up, your hips is going down. You're not pausing. At no point in time, you're pausing. It's all one motion. It's all one motion. And you want to finish on your tiptoes. It's all one motion. You want to finish on your tiptoes. So basically, you're going to grab this ball. Go down, you want to come up, follow through, all in one motion. On your tiptoes, every time. Every time. And the object of this is when you, when you finish, when you finish, let me show you my finish, when you finish, when, it, when, when you're here, you want to hold that follow through at least a second. And when you hold that follow through, you can see yourself. If you finish like, you're finishing like this, and you hold it and you look, you know you did something wrong. If you finish like that, you know you did something wrong. You always want to finish on your toes, elbow in, and at the top, in the top of your jumper. You never, you never want to shoot your jumper like that. You always want to finish at the top. Finish at the top. And my coach growing up always taught me, when you finish your jumper, is all, always think about getting a cookie out the cookie jar. Everybody has a cookie jar. They put their hand to get the cookie jar. Think about getting a cookie out the cookie jar. So when you finish, you're getting a cookie out the cookie jar every time. And that'll help you follow through each and every time. Now we're going to back it up a little bit, just give you a full version. We're going to put it all together. And just, just notice my, my hips, notice my, uh, the, the peak of my jumper, and notice me getting the cookie out the cookie jar. I can do this all day. You want to keep your, keep your, keep your uh, form and you want to keep your uh, hand in the cookie jar. Hand in the cookie jar. Always keep that in mind. Keep that in mind. So we're going to give you a rundown. You want to start here. So you can see it again. Start here, all in one motion. When you come up, you make sure simultaneously you're coming up and dropping those hips at the same time. You're pushing off with your glutes and your legs. It's all legs. On your tiptoes, you follow through. Follow through each and every time. Follow through. There you go. And we back up. Get your feet together. And, and you always remember, you want a one, two into your shot. It's not good for shooters to catch and jump into it. You don't have your balance. You don't have your balance when you jump into it. Good shooters don't jump. It's always a one, two. One, two. One, two. Each and every time. One, two, follow through, hand in the cookie jar. One, two, hand in the cookie jar. Each and every time. Each and every time you do those things and you stick to it and you continue to do it, you continue to do it over and over and over again. Therefore, in the game, it only becomes natural. 
That's how you become a good shooter. And then not only a good shooter, but a great shooter, the more you practice. It comes with hard work, comes with repetitions, and you have to continue to do it and have a work ethic to get better. So that, that concludes my pro tip of the day, and it involves shooting. My name is Mo Williams, NBA professional, basketball player that is. I'm joined here today and give a round of applause for my good friend, Jordy. See you soon.